Whenever I have a call with a guy and he's find out that his wife has first cheated on him, one of the first things I want to establish is does his wife have an appreciable amount of empathy? And a lot of guys are like, yeah, my wife has empathy, but the thing is, is most people don't really understand what that means. What that means is, can that person put themselves in somebody else's shoes and realize that that person is having a human experience? In other words, if I go and I trip and fall, then the narcissist would probably laugh. And if you said, hey, that person hurt themselves, like cracked his head open, he had to get 16 stitches. So the person cannot put themselves in the other person's shoes and feel like what it would be like for that other person. That doesn't mean they don't understand what it is, they just don't give a shit. And they just won't because it's not them and so it doesn't matter. So lack of empathy, the lack of the ability to put themselves in somebody else's shoes and understand the human experience that they're having is absolutely critical for a relationship. If you don't have that, how can you tell how your partner's feeling? And if you can't tell how your partner's feeling, you can't respond to it appropriately. In a relationship that's narcissistic, you'll find that only their issues matter. Yours don't matter. And so usually what will happen is, is like if you're feeling upset, They'll tell you to, you know, hey, you just need to man up. You need to suck it up, whatever. But when she's having an issue, everything must stop in order for her to feel better. And usually they'll have rage outs on these type of things. So lack of empathy. You cannot have a healthy relationship without a healthy amount of empathy. And this can be cultivated, but it is not your job to try to cultivate it in your wife. In fact, if you do this, it will be used against you in ways that you will not anticipate. If you'd like to learn more, my name is Ed Baxter. Find me at genuineattraction.com.